Welcome back to my channel and if you're new my name is Molly Rodriguez and today I'm going to be reviewing Glasses USA. Now this is a site where you can find um, low-end to high-end products uh, as far as eyeglasses and sunglasses go and yeah I really enjoyed my uh, experience on that site and I thought it'd be fun to share with you all uh, what I have already been using and some new purchases as well. A little bit of a background story on me. I have been wearing glasses since I was in third grade. Um, so I've been through many different phases. I ended up wearing contacts for a pretty large majority of middle school and high school. My eyes started becoming very irritated with contact. It kind of just progressed and my eyes started getting infected. I always had a red eye. I was, yeah, it was not a good thing. So be very careful when you wear contacts. Make sure you're very clean with them. I have about, I think, is it eight pairs? I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, but I have lots of pairs to show you guys. So in case you are interested in checking this website out, you'll be able to kind of get an idea of what the quality looks like and yeah, what my experience is like. So these are the first pair. Um, I really like them. These are from the Hilary Duff collection. Hilary Duff is definitely a huge inspiration for me. I loved her when I was young and I love her now. She looks fabulous and I just... When I saw her wearing these glasses, I was like, yeah, I'm going to have them. So the Muse by Hilary Duff, Clara Clear Beige Glitter. Originally when I bought them, they were $133. And I'm very surprised because I didn't realize like how expensive these were a year ago compared to now. So I got the, uh, I was able to kind of look back and see what the prices were when I bought them and what they are now, if they are still available. Um, but yeah, so when I bought these, like I said, they were $133. Um, they are no longer available in this color, but uh, they, they're, they are still available in lots of different other colors. It now costs $94, um, so a very big difference. And yeah, if I was willing to pay the 133, yeah, definitely I would pay the 94. They are very good quality. I really like them. I, re I, I really do. Um, I would suggest it. Now, they are a little bit tight on the side, but after wearing them for a while, um, I guess I have adjusted. Uh, but yeah, so I hope you guys like these. I really recommend them. All right, so this is the next pair, and this is also part of the Hilary Duff collection. Um, and these are called the Zora Clear Pink. Um, and yeah, I really like these compared to the other ones. Um, as you can see, they're different shapes. But uh, these are definitely more of kind of a 50s vibe, kind of more leaning towards a cat eye. Um, it is no longer available in this color, unfortunately. I know they're so cute. I love this light pink. Uh, but they do have some black, I believe, and possibly another color, maybe green. Um, but yeah, they don't fall off my face. They're really nice. And yeah, I would definitely recommend this design. All right, so these are the next pair. These are also in the Hilary Duff collection, and these are called Eva Tortoise. When I originally bought this last year, uh, it was $147, yeah, pretty expensive. Um, it now costs $104, so a pretty big difference, but still on the pricier side. Uh, but yeah, I really like these glasses. Definitely, they're super lightweight, um, very dependable, just, you know, very relaxed. And once again, I saw Hilary Duff wearing them, so I'm like, yeah, I have to have them, so. Okay, so these are the next pair, and it's basically the same the same glasses, just in a sunglass form. But no, I, I mean, I really like these, and I think they're super groovy. Um, let me show you a little hack that I had to do with these. These were, and you can see, they're very wide. Uh, anyway, so uh, I saw a hack as they kept falling off. They were like always here. And I saw that you could get like the little hair bands they use, you know, to tie braids and stuff. 
Um, you just kind of wrap it around here and it acts as like a little bumper so that they don't fall off. Yeah, so anyways, um, so these are also called Eva or Eva um, and these are the sunglasses. These, I forgot to mention, the last ones are still available and uh, these, uh, I believe they're still available as well, yeah. Uh, I don't have a receipt from when I bought them, which is weird, but they now cost $108. So, um, pretty much on the same price side as the rest. But yeah, what do y'all think? I think they're really cute. So these are the, let me put them on. What? There's always hair, like, right? Hopefully it's gone. Um, anyways, so these are called the Chloe CE2131 Shiny Black Gold. The original price on these was like $324 or so. They always have like big discounts and you're about to see a huge one that I got here in a little bit. But at the time, I don't know what discount I got, but it went down to 257 so it's a pretty big amount more than $50 and um, yeah this these are no longer available they're very cute they were they are very cute and I'm definitely gonna wear them more now okay so they came in this little box and this is happy to see you and yes I did already open this uh, I couldn't resist because it was so cute I ordered three glasses in this order so they're so cute, it, they've never come in this little box before. I really like this blue color, very groovy. So this is the first pair. Get these out for you. And oh, take these off. All right, so this is the first pair. Let's try them on. I've already tried them on, but okay. Um, a little bit different for me, but uh, yeah. Um, I think they're a little bit too small for my face. Um, and my, I think my mom thought the same. They're cute, like, I mean, they're very lightweight, but I already have some that are a little bit lightweight. But, you know, I think they do look very, like, official looking. Uh, but yeah, these are called the Muse Arizona Tortoise, and these were $74. So yeah, um, and like I said, these are a recent purchase. But uh, I don't know what y'all think. I mean, you know, they do look a little bit small for my face, so. I'm not 100% sure in it, but uh, yeah, they'll work out. Okay, so the next two I bought are very similar. They almost look exactly alike, uh, but it's this pair here. Yeah, I really think that they're super cute. Let's try them on. Very nice and sturdy. Um, they definitely look more on the plastic side, even with the glass. I don't know. It's... Um, yeah, they, they definitely look on the cheaper side, but I do like them regardless. I think that they're really cute, and uh, if you, I don't know if you could tell, but it has like a blue line that goes around the rim. So these are called the Muse Zoltan Blue Purple Clear, and these were $96. So they're on the more expensive side. Pretty good quality, but like I said, um, you could probably see in the camera just the reflection. I got the most minimum uh, package deal because, like, when you buy the glasses, like, it'll tell you, like, okay, do you want to um, add a blue light, you know, to the glasses, or do you want a uh, blue light protection and all that kind of different stuff? Um, but at, no, I just kind of bought the most basic stuff, so you can improve the quality of the item but it's gonna cost more money. And like I said, if this was the most minimum, it was 96. So here's the thing, I just keep saying, oh yeah, it's super expensive, but for glasses, they're very cheap. Um, I've bought glasses in the past that were probably, I mean, hence the ones that I bought, the Chloe ones that were 200 and whatever. Um, so yeah, these are definitely on the cheaper side, but I guess for me, naturally, I'm thinking that they're more expensive. But anyways, yeah, I think that they're pretty cute. And yeah, let's go to the next one. So these are the ones I have not been able to resist to wear uh, daily, every day, um, since I got them last week. But yeah, these are the beauties, and I think that they're so, like I said, they're almost exactly the same. 
but these do not have the blue line that goes through it these are just clear kind of like my pink ones but if you notice they're a little bit more on the yellow tone um, I'll kind of get it close to the camera maybe you can see kind of more on, uh, on a yellow tone and that's because they have the blue light protection which is nice when you're like staring at a computer all day um, but yeah so try these on and yeah it makes everything looks a lot more orangey toned which is kind of nice kind of like adding like a Instagram filter or something um, but yeah these are definitely my favorite of all the glasses sorry glasses <laughs> But uh, yeah, I, I think that these are really cute. And uh, yeah, these are called the Sam Clear Purple and these were $81, so even cheaper. I did wanna mention, so the three glasses that I just got um, in the mail, sorry, I have a whole disaster back here. Anyways, um, the three that I got in the mail originally cost, let me check, um, originally was gonna come out to $251. Um, and it went down to 149. Um, I'm trying to remember what I did to get the discount. I think that there was just a discount code available and I was able to, you know, plop that in and it, um, and it gave me a discount. So, you know, there's definitely some great discounts that they have and, you know, always just keep an eye out for that kind of stuff. But uh, yeah, definitely the prices have gotten lower from a year ago, and that's really nice. Uh, would I recommend buying from Glasses USA? Definitely. Um, I, like I said, I have bought from cheaper websites in the past. I was not satisfied, but I feel like Glasses USA is like provides options that are cheap enough to where they're not gonna be breaking on you. Let me be honest. I don't like to wear glasses, and I feel like it doesn't really reflect my like my fashion it doesn't represent my overall look that I want to achieve but it's reality it's what I have to do so I decided you know what I'm gonna try to embrace glasses as best as I can and like I said these last this last pair is definitely something that I love this color I love how it looks on me and I think that if you're in that position of not loving how you look with glasses on you need to experiment you need to experiment with different uh, different sizes, different shapes, different colors. And it's not easy to do that because, you know, we don't just have money on hand to buy glasses, right? Um, but it's nice that you have this option like Glasses USA that you can actually um, have different options. And uh, with that in mind, I want to mention that my next video is going to be going right along that. and showing you different outfits that uh, I create with glasses just so you can kind of get some ideas on that but with that in mind thank you guys so much for coming and checking out this video I hope that you can go and give Glasses USA a little check out and I'm just kind of putting this out there they're not sponsoring me or anything I just wanted to share my thoughts and experiences and I hope that you all enjoyed this video um, I would love if you could like and subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. I s upload every Tuesday and Thursday. But anyways, y'all have a great day and a great week. And I'll be seeing you on Thursday. Bye, guys. <laughs>